one thing that 2020 has taught us is that we have to plan ahead and be flexible. So we're constantly trying to figure out the best way to move forward as a family. And we had hoped to open the children's area on November 8th. We see now with the numbers rising like they are that that is just not a great idea. So we're coming up with another plan and we're being flexible. We are figuring out how to bring families together. Those who feel ready to come back, we want you back. If you're not ready, we understand. But if you are ready, here's the plan. We think we've come up with a few unique ways to include you and your children in our Sunday morning worship services. We would like to introduce to you the family campsite. Each campsite is an enclosed space for families to worship together in a way that you can let your children play on the floor or kind of wiggle around a little bit and you don't have to worry about the rest of the congregation being distracted. Please let us reiterate to you, we do not mind children making noise in services, kids laughing, singing, answering, answering rhetorical questions. All of these things enhance the worship service for us, but if this helps make you and your family feel more comfortable, we would love for you to take advantage of those things. And if you've got an older kid, about K through three, or even crew 456, we have adventure kits for you. These are similar to what we've been doing with busy bags, uh, but we'd like to invite you to use your quiet toys or bring your own so that you can get all your fidgets out while you're listening to service. You can reserve a family campsite when you register your family for Sunday morning worship. There will be a place for you to leave a comment letting us know that you would like to try one of these sites out. So this is what we're doing here at Grandview, here at the Buffalo campus, which means we are... We're also doing it at City View. And we'd like to remind you that we will keep everything as clean as possible by sanitizing between services, between weeks, between children sticking things in their mouths and everything. So if you're ready to come back, and the way to know if you're ready to come back is look at all the other things you might be doing. If you're doing a lot of things, but you're not worshiping God, and you're ready to come back, we're ready to have you. We look forward to seeing you and your family sometime soon on a Sunday. Bye.